You know, when I started climbing in 71, I was 12 years old. We had two libraries in Davis, and I read every book, every magazine in both the libraries on climbing. So I read about all these guys, and they were like my heroes. And to meet them in person, man, it was like a lifetime dream and to become friends with them, and for them to be excited about what I'm doing and to encourage me, um, that's why I do it. Everyone who comes into this place, you can't help but to get excited about it, whether you climb or not, simply because it's all here. The stories, the gear, the photographs, that's what this place is about. Bob Swift, uh, Alan Steck's photographs, Glenn Denny's photographs, Tom Frost's photographs. So, uh, though it's from the same time period or from the uh, first descent of the nose on El Capitan, the most famous piece of gear that they made was what's called the stove leg piton. Uh, first four were made by Frank Tarver. Rich Calderwood made three. The reason he only made three was that when he went to the, the junkyard and let the proprietor know what he was going to do with it, in other words, he was just going to saw the legs off, throw the stove away, he'd only sell him a three-legged stove. He wouldn't sell him a good one. What I like are the stories. There's like so many stories and, and I want to hear more. I'm so excited about this space in Mariposa because I think it will become a place for the community to gather and also for collectors within the community to see special climbing artifacts and photography from local and global climbers. Our intentions were to open this place in April or May. Obviously, that's not going to happen now. What we are intending on doing now is uh, trying to go online and trying to keep the rent and the lights on until things change and we can become that meeting place. But really, it's, it's, it's our culture. Without art, you can't have culture. And climbing has that art. Climbing is that art. All of us were joined together by our common history. That's why right now, we're asking you to do anything you can to keep this flame moving forward.